Welcome back to Lemma. I would want to say that this is gonna be the last episode, but I actually kind of doubt it will, because we only have a couple more achievements to do, but I had a look at the challenge levels, and there are actually quite a few. For the achievement, if we just bring that up, you only need to play one, so we could just play one and then leave it, but there are official challenge levels in the game, and they say that they use the advanced strategies and advanced maneuvers, so it could be kind of interesting to play through. So I think I will play through if we just take a look in here. You can see official levels. There's five levels here and then one at the end here. And the rest, I assume, are just like, it says just campaign, so I assume it's just the same levels as in the main game. But we might check those out too, if there's like some difference. Is there like a time trial? Is there... A reason to play them in the challenge menu compared to the new game menu. I don't know, but yeah, this is probably too much for one episode. So chances are we're gonna have to play for a bit longer in Lemma. But there's also workshop levels, which I will not delve into at all on camera. I will say right away. And then there are, there's a level editor, which we need to make one level and publish it and I'm going to at least dip into it and just check how it works and then like make a complete non-level and just like upload it just for the achievement and delete it right afterwards. So we'll see about that. But I figured before we get into the challenge levels, there are just two more achievements that we haven't gotten. I mean, I've technically sort of gotten this, but not really. So I need to do that on my own. And this one will get soon. This one will get soon. And then there's one more. So, God Mode, apparently, is just simple enough. It's just input the Konami code on on the title screen, even though it's not a Konami game, just a little Easter egg. So, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A. God Mode activated, and then you can press a key to open the console, and I get the achievement, so that's cool. Didn't know if that was actually gonna work. You can edit levels as well. You can, like, actually edit the real levels of the main game. Which is interesting, maybe I could go in and fucking delete the the annoying enemies. That could be cool, but I will not do that. I will not do any of that. Can I, like, do it again? No? I did it wrong. No, so doing it again does not, like, reverse it or anything, so I guess I would have to quit out to exit god mode, but... Guess it doesn't really matter, right? I hope. Maybe it doesn't actually register achievements when you're in god mode. I don't know. But there's one, one last one. If we go to the global, just so you can see it. Pillar of Hope. And I guess, oh, it actually, yeah, this is actually kind of a good clue. I had to look this up because I didn't really think about it too much. But yeah, this is actually a decent achievement, I think. Like, the the name is a, a is a hint. And the icon is a hint, so you might be able to figure out what that is, but it was very, very long ago that this was relevant, so I forgot, I had to look it up, and apparently all it is is we just go to forest, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, right here, oh, it's very loud, need to lower my volume. Yeah, I think it's in this area where you have to, yep. Where you have to, like, link up some, uh, thingies? I don't even know what to call them. Like, platforms that then make these pillars rise up in the sky. And apparently, yeah, right here. And apparently, you get an achievement just for, like, making one of the pillars move up and then riding it up and getting squished. So, let's do that. No! No! Damn it! Ah, well... Uh, can't load or anything. Guess I have another chance. I can just go to another pillar, but damn it, that one was probably the easiest one. Um. Okay, there we go. Alright, here's another one. This should be easy enough as well. Oh, what? Only one? God damn it, I thought you had to do both. Shit. And I can't get over there. Yeah, I actually can. Jump, kick, 
and then roll. You just have to like reset the animation, I suppose. You can't do it in too quick succession. That's something I was completely wrong about. I thought it was like locked out. Come on. No, 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 no. God damn it. What? Where? Oh my god, I'm all the way back here. Good lord. It would be faster if I just go to the main menu and then just do new game in forest and just run over here. I can just make a quick save when I get there as well. Oh, right. I wonder, can you be quick enough to just jump out before the wall is in place? Probably. Oh, not quite enough distance. Also, I should probably turn off just for FPS reflections. I just turned it on in the main menu because the main menu looks awful without reflections because it's all water and it's just like a flat color, pretty much. Okay, don't touch it. Make a save. There we go, and then we try again. Get up. There we go. And achievement. Pillar of Hope. Just got squished. Yeah. So that's it. Another little secret achievement. And that's also kind of kind of neat. I like that one. Yeah, look at this. It looks so, so bad. But yeah, that's it for the achievements. And now we only have challenge levels left to do. So I guess we'll just jump into the first one and, and check. Holy crap. This looks neat. I wonder if I can turn up any options just to make it look a bit nicer. Oh, I had shadows on. I didn't even mean for that. Like, it's still 120 FPS, so let's just see. Oh, yep, okay, timer. I'm not gonna worry about the time or the leaderboards or anything, but let's just see how... how the levels all play out. I'm just gonna, like, go through them at my own pace and look around and stuff, not really worry. Because, yeah, like, what if I just jump up here? I... Is this just the entire level? You just go in here and that... Oh. Well, I died and lost... the time. So this is the entire level, I suppose. And I guess you would probably want to, like, kick a lot, because kicking just increases your speed. But I'm sure there are many more ways you can like oh you just have to touch it not even go in yeah many more ways you can wait huh oh i thought this was like the top leaderboards no i'm 400 and i assume number one is like fucking two seconds or something can't even really check oh i have a friend who played the game i didn't even know that um Maybe that's the guy who even recommended the game to me. I, I can't remember. If that's you, thanks. But if it's not you, thanks. Switch to edit mode. Yeah, I, I guess that's it. So you cannot, you cannot see where you are on the leaderboards, like, or what times the other people have, unless you go out and then check the leaderboards from the main menu, I suppose. But I won't bother trying to get a really good time or anything. I'm just gonna go through... The levels and just just have fun and we'll just wow it's so quiet why is it so quiet that's a bit weird wish there was some music at least oh what oh oh hi eh, I guess that's fine I'm not gonna worry too much where am I going though I hope I'm going the right way that's not the right way. Damn. So I just die now and you have to retry the entire thing. Yep. Holy crap. That's pretty harsh. Even on max settings, this area looks kind of bad, I would say. It's like really... I don't even know what to call it. Bland? Can I make it all the way there? I cannot. Oh my god, what am I doing? Keep kicking. Nope. It just looks kind of washed out, or too red, I don't even know. But alright, let's just follow the natural path of the area.
Do I want to try climbing up here? I think I do. That seems like a neat... Ow! Neat idea. Okay, good. Is that the goal over there, or...? I can't run there. Shit, damn. I felt like I had a good thing going there. Damn it, too bad. Ah, uh, that's not great. <laughs> Climb up here quick. There we go. Oh, fuck. Okay. Have to adapt. Let's go around this way instead. That should be fine. Okay, that's not where I'm going. That's just more death. I can't make it here. No, you cannot do that. There's the exit. Okay, so it's not too far. Yeah, I think I'm just... I'm trying to go too fast. I'm trying to, like, keep up the pace. I should try and think a bit more about what I'm doing. Ow. So yeah, wait here, now slide, then jump kick. Much better. Get over here. That's probably a lot better. Hopefully we can just run past this guy. This seems like you're meant to go here. Yep, 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 yep. And the oh, come on, really? That's bullshit. Again, hate these enemies. They're always fucking annoying. That that felt like a good time too. Like that was actually a pretty solid run. I'm sure there are much better. Oh, I'm going a different way now. Guess I'm freestyling. Not freestyling for long. Oh, didn't mean to do that, but I guess that's fine. Oh, don't do that again. Jesus, that's weird. Okay, that's a good jump. Do that, definitely do that. Now I just have to avoid getting shot here at the end. So like, what the, come on, what's going on? I don't understand, nothing is shooting me. I don't see any laser, I went to the right, I can go straight, nothing matters. It just, I just die. So what's shooting me now? That thing. And what do I do about it? Apparently if I run and jump, it still tracks me perfectly if I, like nothing I do makes it stop killing me. So what, what's the deal? Like, these other ones are totally fine, they just aim at where I was, and then, like, if I just keep moving, it's totally fine. But that one is like... Oh, that was bad. Oh well. Don't care about the time as long as I keep going. Maybe I should just not go there, maybe this is a bad route. Instead I could try doing, like... No, no, no. No, no, no. This or something, and then... Ah, oh, crap. No, that's too, too far. It seriously seems like that's the only route you can take at the end, and that's, like, impossible to not die to. Well, I guess I'll just keep doing it, and then probably gonna be quite a bit of cutting, I would imagine. If I'm just gonna be grinding over and over, hoping that I don't get killed. Right, I think what I was saying earlier was, I'm sure there are, like, way, way better speedrun methods in this game. Crap. Couldn't 
make any ground there. Like this whole thing I'm doing with like sliding and then jump kicking and then sliding and then jump kicking. I'm sure there's many ways of going much, much faster than this, but this is pretty simplistic and still goes fairly quick. Ow. Can't really go on the right there either. Okay, let's just drop down. Keep going, keep going. Fuck you. Holy shit, if that would have killed me. Oh my god, there we go. Alright, that was fairly okay. Hey, top 100. I am a-okay with that. Let's go to the next one. Please don't- oh. Please don't have any enemies. Orbs? What do you mean, orbs? Why would there be orbs in a challenge level? Is it like- Oh, yeah, you see all the orbs, and here's the exit. I see, so you need to collect all three orbs, and then you can exit. Okay, that's kind of cool. It's like a little time trial treasure hunt. If only there weren't any enemies. It would be much, much better. Yeah, there it is. And I need to do some fancy wall jumping to get it. And then survive, and then I guess if I die, I lose everything. Joy. And man, these fucking black things too, because it's like, if they see me, you just die. And I do not want to die. Excuse me? Do I have to kick this? Ah! I see. And then climb up, use it as a stepping stool. That's, that's fine. Run up here. Oh damn, didn't get it. There we go. Okay, and then avoid the guy. Can you like quick save and stuff in these levels, I wonder? I'm gonna go around. I'm not gonna care about my time. I want to make sure I don't die from that guy. Oh, he's like fucking camping the place. I guess you just have to go for it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was slow, but hey, still 102. Not too bad. And first try. Nice. And now we get orb powers. Cool. All right, that's fine, I suppose. Ah, I see. So now I'm powering this, and then wall running over here. Accidentally destroying it. Oh, fuck. Well, that was my bad. I guess you can just, like, wall run here. Yeah, it's a bit easier. Oh yeah, I should, like, wall run it up right away as well. Ah, whatever. Just create anything. So, what am I trying to- holy shit! What am I trying to get it to? Ah, over here! And you can use this to purge the red. Uh... Or can you? I- I still don't understand the black. It just doesn't make any sense to me. Whoops. What is happening? Why am I, like, slowing down by 99%? That was strange. Ow. So... What do you want to try and do here? Damn it, I didn't want to do that. Yeah, holy shit, this red is so annoying. Good lord. And now I need to, like, power it all up again. Why do you create stuff like that? I just want to, like, keep going. Can I just 
run to it? Is it fine now? Uh, oh, and then it opens up there, I see. But does the connection need to stay open? Nope, guess not. Okay, well... Oh, still 54. I thought that was super slow and bad, but hey, I'll take what I can get. And three orbs. Okay, so this must be the last level before the, like, normal campaign levels. And I guess, yeah, the, the campaign levels in the challenge mode will probably have time trials and stuff. So maybe we do want to run through them just, like, one more time. Just to set a time. Doesn't matter what time. Just any time. No enemies here, as far as I can see. Which makes me instantly love this level. Nope, there's red. Right? That's red. I think that's red. Is that red? No, that's not red. That's just a weird, like, effect happening. Don't have my orb power. Or, a uh, block power. So that, and then let's go this way. Like so. And then the Tesseract was where? Tesseract is down there. Shouldn't be too bad. Can I survive here? I think I can. Yeah, cool. Alright, that wasn't too bad. 70. Great. Notes? Huh? What? Wait, which level am I in? Can you see that anywhere? Challenge levels. Um, I guess I can just go to Rubicon. Yeah, that's the one I just did. So, they're just like challenge levels based on the original. They're not actually the original. No, they are the original levels. I see. Yeah, I thought it, it looked different. But no, this is actually exactly... Is it? Is that what it was before? I don't even know. Huh. Well, I think it's a bit early, but I think I might just want to leave it off here for today, because now we're like... We've done the new ones, except the last one. There's one more at the at the very end, which we'll leave for later. And then now it's just all of the uh, normal levels, but I guess you have to collect orbs on the way. So it could still be interesting to do. So I will do it. I will imagine it's going to be another one to two episodes, depending on how long these levels take. So, join me if you care about it. Don't if you don't. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode at any rate. And I'll see you next time, maybe. Bye-bye!